Ladies and gentlemen, today we're gonna break down, all right, how you guys can maximize your stamina, use as much stamina as possible, gain stamina faster than a regular person, even though that's literally not possible, but I'm gonna teach you guys how you guys can do that today um, by, you know, being smart with your stamina, different ways you guys can refill your stamina, get more stamina. I'm gonna break down every single way um, that you guys can play more events so you guys can make more coins and XP, because, you know, a lot of you guys in the comments down below have been asking me, you know what I'm saying? Hefe, how do you how, how do you how do you always play events? I, every time I watch your videos you know, or watch your live stream, you're always playing something. You always got 355 stamina. I'm here to teach you how I you know what I'm saying I work my magic because you know what I'm saying I, I I'm just that nice with it. So without further ado, let's just jump right into it. So obviously you're gonna use stamina to play programs like Madden today. Uh, you're probably using stamina to play uh, other things like Master Series uh, for Kamara or Training Camp or Juju or whoever you're playing for. Um, or you could be, I don't know, playing it for, do you even use it for arena? I don't think, yeah, you do use it for arena. You have to put like 50 every day. And if you don't get it, you might have to put another 50 in just to put, uh, play more arena. But how do we maximize our stamina? How do we make sure that we play as many events, get as much XP as possible and as much coins as possible? Um, just, you know, to fully utilize the stamina. We don't want to waste the stamina. Uh, and we also don't want to waste a key thing about stamina. And that is the timer. We don't want to waste the timer at all. This year for Madden Mobile 20, one stamina is a minute. So it'll pretty much take me 355 minutes to fully refill all of my stamina if I played all of my 292 stamina that I have right now. All right. So uh, first of all, let me just get this out of the way. The first couple of ways you guys can do it. Obviously, you guys can use gems or cash to, you know, go uh, go get 200 stamina. I wouldn't do it, but I mean, it, it's, it's a way you guys can do it. So uh, I mean, if you guys want to do that, go ahead. But it's not really the most appealing method to get a lot of stamina because it's like, man, like, I don't want to, I mean, I don't want to use gems to open packs. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to pull 85s out of these packs. I'm trying to use cash to pull 85s you feel me like i'm not gonna use this stamina to to, to get stamina no, wait what no i'm not trying to use gems or cash to get stamina you feel me i'm just trying to you know what i'm saying i'm trying to pull i'm trying to pull deha i'm trying to pull deha you feel me so look first thing you guys should do is always look at your level always look at how much xp you have right now um, I'm like around 700 XP away from my next level and when you always reach your next level You always get five more stamina and you get a full stamina refill So uh, right now I'm 700 away and you should also take a look at your daily goals because these things can kill you These things give you 500 XP and they can level you up without you noticing So the key is you want to play every event before you level up and what what I mean by that is right now All the Madden Today events they have 34 minutes left so I can let's let's just jump right into it Let's just jump into I don't know a Madden Mint right here and what you guys want to do is don't actually play the event because when you play the event you're gonna get the XP from it and you know you might go past the XP limit or whatever so the smart way to do it is actually go save and exit and leave after every single event that you play because is my game frozen? Okay, my game's not frozen. Because you guys don't want to play these until you reach the next level. Now, the reason you don't want to do this is you want to use as much XP before the refill comes. Now, you're probably wondering, like, hold on. The X, the, the stamina stacks up on each other. So, like, why does this make a difference at all? Um, the reason this makes a difference is because when you get to the next level and let's say you play another event, the timer starts right away. The minute timer starts right away. And that's what I mean by you guys got to recognize the timer uh, difference between the stamina difference. And uh, you guys got to realize that the timer doesn't start when you're over the stamina limit the t the the because you're over the stamina limit there's no stamina to gain you already have more stamina than the maximum uh li limit so they're like okay well i mean just keep playing your stamina until your stamina gets back below the limit which means you guys got to be playing all of these events just go in the event uh, there should be more events than that. I don't know what's going on. I think they took out the Legends promo. That's probably why. Um, even if it's solo, Master Series, uh, for Kamara, for whoever. Right now, you can't actually quit or save and exit out of an Overdrive match. So, I wouldn't recommend that. I'd recommend actually playing those. But right here, let's just keep playing, you know, these little drill packs. Um, just, to, just, to, just to cut down my XP. Uh, the lower you get it before you level up, the better. Because you want to use as much stamina before you level up. That's just pretty much the key in this video. Here we go. Second event. Just finished it save and exit didn't even play a single snap you hear me just get out of here right away uh 10 stamina down the drain which is fine uh we could also do this scenario pack just avoid every single overdrive because overdrive they don't let you save and exit um i think i said that earlier i literally said that like a minute and a half ago i don't know why i'm saying that again but 
um, save and exit. And another thing you guys can do if the game lets me get out of the screen um, is you guys can go to locker um, or not locker, front office, locker, same thing, technology, and you guys can actually get uh, stamina boosts right here, like program stamina reducers uh, for briefcases or whatever suitcases whatever you want to call it uh you guys want to get those because those will actually help you a lot regen booster too you know what i'm saying it, it just makes it faster so i mean i'm just giving you guys the different ways you guys can do it uh so now that we've pretty much quit out of every single event that we could play leagues there's nothing there competitive uh, i guess we can enter into the arena match uh but actually not play a single arena match so we can go start um and we can just run it up um okay it's actually not gonna it's actually not gonna take any stamina away because i haven't like played arena in a while but if i lost let's say i lost because you know what i'm saying I, I don't ever lose but let's say i lost um it would tell me to you know use 50 stamina to buy back in which is pretty much what you guys want to do you guys want to use as much stamina before you level up so now we go back to our daily goals we've spent 300 stamina uh that's obvious and then we're gonna get uh, 500 XP and now we're 200 away. So let's just use I don't know. Let's just use training points Let's upgrade the juju right here and we're gonna level up All right now now that we're gonna level up our XP or our stamina is gonna go through the roof. All right um, Let's take a look. How much stamina are we gonna get? We're gonna get 300 stamina and five plus uh, on our limit. So now we have 477 stamina So now what you guys can do is start playing these events and you know it's not going to take as long for you to get back below the stamina limit to start your timer up again now um there wasn't enough events for me to actually uh fully milk this method but if you guys have a lot of events or if you guys have um just been grinding a lot you guys should be doing this get below your stamina limit when your stamina refills all right and that's pretty much the best way you can maximize stamina use because i know you guys you know you guys love playing events for some reason i don't know about you guys uh, you guys love playing season mode too i see a lot of you guys in the comments down below saying i play season mode i'm in like season nine i freaking have like two super bowls I, I don't know man you guys would be flexing those little super bowl season super bowls i don't know why but hey you guys do you all right that's pretty much the end of this video if this video helped you at all make sure you guys leave a like make sure you guys subscribe let me know in the comments down below what other videos you guys want to see and um take care